the reaction from students, faculty, and staff has been really positive about lighting um, Century Tower um, and the, the rainbow lights. Um, most of our students, faculty, and staff are really looking to have an opportunity to come together to join together with one another in unity and solidarity with Orlando, with the victims, and with the LGBTQ and uh, Latinx communities. Um, to, to rally together in support of those communities during this really trying and difficult time. Um, and so I think everybody's been really excited about it. I've actually seen some posts on Facebook from incoming students saying that they're from Orlando and this really makes them feel at home on campus coming here for Summer B. So that's really great. That's really what we want to do. Community-wise, um, I mean obviously everyone is banding together and standing together in this really, really, really hard time. and coming together to support each other as fellow queer people, supporting each other to get through this, but more so supporting the victims, supporting their families, their friends, etc. Um, I feel like a lot of people are downplaying the role that um, race had in this. The majority of the victims were POCs or people of color, um, as heavily well, Latinx. So people are really downplaying that. And yes, while we appreciate the support, there isn't a lot of visibility uh, for people of color in this time. Um, this goes without saying, but this was a terrible tragedy. And it, it warms my heart seeing the support that, is, that I've experienced personally from people that I know, people that I work with, etc. cetera. Um, and just like, Worldwide, the, just the support and camaraderie and just all of that positivity that's coming out of this, 